later. Two thousand years later. One. Eat. Okay, they're done. Look at this. Okay, we've got just a little bit of jiggle left here. All right. See. Okay. Now what we want to do is let this settle and relax. Okay. It's basically baked about almost like a cake. We wanted to. Let it be a little bit underdone, okay, so that there would be some gooey spots in the bottom. We'll let this cool down, and then we'll uh, cut a piece off and give it a go. So, we'll be right back. All right, folks. So, uh, we let our, our peanut butter brownies cool down for a little while. Now, when I baked them, uh, we baked them for about 40 minutes, about 25 minutes on one side, and then about 15 minutes on the other. So, I'm going to go ahead and pop these out. Uh, what I like to do is just take one of my little spatulas and go around the edge, just like this, just to that make sure that it's... Seal, right? Yeah, just to make sure. I mean, it's... It really... There's no uh, no stick, but it, breaking the seal is always good. Oh, there's a little spot. See, now that would have given me a problem. So, that's what we're looking for. Okay. All right, so now what I'm going to do is... Pop this sucker out like this, and it's still a little bit warm. Oh, that man, looks so nice, John. Oh, yeah. All right, so now very gently peel it, right? <laughs> there we go. All right, look at that nice fudgy. Fudgy parts. Oh, that looks beautiful. All right, now what I'm going to do is take this paper right on here like so. I'm going to use another sheet pan. Oops. There we go. All right, now we'll give it another flipperooski. There we go. All right, let me get some... Uh, Something sharp here. Oh god, that's what's amazing. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so you like the edge or the center? I'm an edge guy. Yeah. They're, they're all good. <laughs> oh look at that. Oh my. Oh, it's so amazingly moist. See that? Oh. See the peanut butter all the way through? Mmm. Alright, here you go. You want the quarter? Yeah. yeah. There you go. Thank you, sir. Folks at home, look at this. Look at that. Oh. Cheers. Cheers. Nice and cakey and fudgy right there in the center. See, you got your peanut butter milk. Uh, mix through. Oh, yeah. Oh. The cheese <laughs> and the peanut butter is really good. Mmm. Isn't that yummy? Oh, wow. Now, a little bit of chocolate ganache would be really good on top of this, too. Mm-hmm. Just saying. In fact, if I use these on a cookie tray, mm, that's probably what I'd do. I'd have a little bit of fudge on top. Mm. That's yummy. Nice little peanut butter aftertaste. Mm. Isn't that good? Divine. <laughs> mm. <laughs> yeah, not wow. too much to say after that. Just a lot of chewing. I suppose I could have probably used the rest of the peanut butter on top. You know, okay. I mean, I um, I think that, okay, when you take a look at it, I thought that I was adding a lot more peanut butter on top. Probably could have done, you know, even used more. But, uh, you know, you always got to learn something on each batch you do every time you make something. Boy, that center is really fudgy and gooey and yummy. I really like that. Mm -hmm. 
So, well, folks, I hope you've enjoyed our video. And uh, hope you've learned something. And if not, at least been mildly entertained. And uh, remember, when you bake... When you bake with love and passion, everything you make is going to be delicious. See, you can't go wrong. It doesn't matter what you make. And uh, we we'll hope to see you next time on our next video. So God bless and happy baking. Thank you. And don't forget, like, subscribe, and share the video. And please leave us comments because we do want to hear from you guys what you would like to see us make for you. It's always helpful when you do. Thank you.